Meet Dana. Oh, you know Dana. He's only been in nine vlogs. We have a playlist together, and he has a whole video made just for him. So, Dana is from Charleston, West Virginia, which is here. And he goes to school in Huntington, which is here. Since things have been going great between us, he decided to move all the way to Columbus, Ohio for the summer so that we could live closer to each other. I mean, I didn't think we'd be this close, but still. In order to move, we had to get an apartment for him to live in, we had to get someone to live in his apartment, and we had to find him a new job. We found an apartment, even though it sucks, we found someone to live in his apartment, and we started the search for a job. Dana is a political science major with the aspirations to be a lawyer, so we reached out to some law firms but couldn't find anything for an undergrad, so we expanded our search to look outside of law. That's when Dana got an email from a marketing agency asking to interview him. He killed the interview and had the job all lined up. So we're all good, right? No. The internship we thought Dana had was actually a company that switches locations without telling anyone, switched the name of their company, and wanted Dana to go door to door as a salesman. So that was out the window and we started over. Thinking about how to score some discounted swag, we headed to Easton to get Dana a job at a store we love to shop at. So we went to Paxson and he got the job on the spot. So we're all good, right? No. Why would anyone in their right minds move two and a half hours away just so they could drive 30 minutes to work at a mall that pays you minimum wage? So we were at square one. No job for Dana. But why feel sorry for yourself? Why give up? Why settle? Dana wants to be a lawyer, so why can't he get a job at a law firm? Yeah, all the applications online say you need to be a second year law student, but why? So we took matters into our own hands. We sat in a coffee shop for two hours straight and did nothing but send out emails. Email after email after email. It wasn't long before we had sent over 50 emails to different law firms around the city of Columbus. The pitch was simple. Introduce yourself and your experience, tell them why you're in Columbus, and ask if they need an intern. And now we wait. In less than a week, we had not one, not two, but six responses from law firms that either wanted his resume or wanted to bring him in for an interview. So we had an in. Now Dana had to get prepared. So after some follow-up, some phone calls, and some company research, Dana was ready for a day of three interviews. One on the phone and two in person. The first interview went okay, and the phone call was better, but one interview stood out. One interview went better than good, it went great. But again, we had to wait. Finally, on Thursday, May 17th, 2018, Dana got a job offer. Working downtown at a law firm with people he liked a lot. So when you think about giving up or settling for less than what you want, stop. If you weren't successful at first, then try harder, work harder, never quit, and eventually you will be successful. Congratulations on the job, Dana. Work hard, and let's enjoy the summer.